Attracting and working with luxury clients is very easy to do and very easy to attract them if we set our mindset to this is a niche that I want to work. And I'm going to show you today how you can use landing pages and squeeze pages to generate luxury listings for free. You, of course, could pay for them to get more leads, but I'm going to show you a guide to how to use landing pages and luxury lead pages so that you can then get them into your database, nurture them, and build your dream clients. Okay, let's jump in. I'm Kim Barber with Kim Barber Group and eXp Realty, and I've helped thousands of owners and agents with real estate since 2004. So before we get started in a full demo, I do want to just quickly talk about what is a landing page. So in here, this is a landing page. There is a URL. And if you already know this, I'm just going to cut to it really quickly because uh, if you don't, a landing page really quickly is just a website page, a URL here, where we're going to direct somebody to land. And then in return, we're going to offer something to them. That could be text. It could be a list. It could be a video. It's just simply where we're going to land somebody. So some people try to overthink this. And so I just want to make it super simple. If for example, your website, which most of them have has like, what's your home value. So when they click on here, this is a page you could land. So you could take this URL and you could advertise it. For example, you could go to your Facebook group, Facebook page, and you could create a post and then you could, you know, paste it and then just say curious what your home is worth today, click the link below, right? And so then if, if somebody were to click this link, then it's going to redirect them to a, a page, right? And then it's going to redirect them in fact to this page, that's where they're gonna land, okay? So simple, just wanted to kind of knock that out of the way and then you would see it right here. Again, somebody would click on the page. They would be expecting to come to a place that's gonna show them what their home is worth. All right, so in our example here, what we wanna do is we wanna create a landing page. I'm gonna use KV Core as the demo, but quite honestly, there are many uh, sites and software systems that you can use to create landing pages. So let's just jump in and we're going to build this landing page. With KB Core as an example, you can do many different kinds. It says lead generation, video view, um, text, address, you know, capture, etc. But in the example, what we promise to talk about is how to get luxury clients, how to get luxury leads, how to get luxury buyers, sellers. You know, anybody that's coming to a luxury landing page likely also has a home to sell, right? So if they're going to go buy a home that's over a million dollars the chances are pretty high that they're going to have a house to sell, right? So this is going to attract buyers who most likely also have a home to sell. Okay. So let's jump in. So the, what we want to do is we want to create some content around what kind of information would a luxury buyer want? So most people go to a website and then they would say like luxury homes in Loudoun County, Virginia. Right. That's a county. You could put your town, you could put whatever, but let's not try to overthink it. You know, a uh, free list of hot buys in a uh, free list of luxury, luxury homes in, um, in our area. Right. Um, and you could name towns, right. In Ashburn, um, Hamilton, you know, you could just start writing whatever you wanted. But the point is, is that you want to, what is it that you're advertising? What are you offering to get somebody? We're real estate agents. Typically, most people want a list of homes. What's their home worth or some content around um, like selling a luxury property. And so then in here, you would want to go and massage this, right? So just think about like, what is the kind of content that you would be offering? So you would say um, homes with over 0.5 acres. Um, you know, and then you would kind of just continue to massage this um, new construction homes included, you know, a free instant weekly updates. Um, you could say um, uh, horse properties, you know, you could just write whatever you wanted. 
but you want to just tailor into that. If you're more in the city, you know, maybe you want to do condos and you can kind of massage the kind of homes because we, in our example, are going to send them to a link because we wanted them to start subscribing to a list of homes that shows them what they want. So then another thing about the landing pages, um, the strategy behind landing pages also is that we want to be able to know where they came so that we can add the value of what they wanted and then become top of mind. So for example, if I went to a place and said, I want luxury homes in Loudoun County, but I started getting homes that weren't luxury homes in Loudoun County, I'd probably delete the, the button, you know, delete. And then, but if I wanted to see, in fact, luxury homes of Loudoun County, I'm actually going to give you my email and my real phone number. And quite honestly, I would like to get more information about luxury homes of Loudoun County. So there's a huge chance that they're actually going to give you real information. And then when you call and add value, you could say, hey, I noticed that you were looking for luxury homes. I'm just curious, are you looking for a custom home? Are you looking for something to do specifically with the property? You know, if you want to land, are you thinking horse farm, winery? Did you just want some privacy? Are you looking for a neighborhood? And then now we're adding value, right? We're getting top of mind. So it's not just about the home page or the landing page. It's also about how do we rise to the top and actually land with our nurturing and lead follow-up skills. So that's more videos that I um, have on the site or will be having on the site to so look for those. Getting back to how to build a landing page, you wanna think about that when you're building the content here. Okay, so in the hashtag, I wanna be able to then, if I have a luxury listing, I wanna be able to like broadcast it out to the people that have come. So this is what you wanna think about from a strategy point of view is how do we wanna be able to search on these uh, buyers that we're putting into our CRM system. So I'm going to put luxury um, home uh, list, right? Luxury home buyer um, in Loudoun County, right? I'm just being specific, nothing wrong with that. So, um, and then you could put landing page, but then you would say, what's on this? This is submit button. That's right here. So see this list now, and then you could say, see luxury um, listings now. You know, see, see, you know, see homes listed today. All right, that's specific. And then now, where are we sending them to? So now that gets to a squeeze page. So in our example, this is optional, but in order for us to like give them the list, then we have to create the list. So in KV Core, you might have heard the term squeeze page. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how that works. So again, in KV Core, and in, in our example here, you're going to build a landing page which is what we've done here. In our example, we're trying to get luxury um, buyers and sellers because most luxury buyers are also sellers. And then we're going to now build the squeeze page. So what that means is it's a squeeze page. It's like not all the properties in Loudoun County. We're squeezing it together to show in my example, I'm gonna do homes that have some land and are above a certain price range in Loudoun County. Okay, so let's jump into that. And so um, here, I particularly, um, I'm going to do properties with land. So I'm going to pick Loudoun is my county. So let's let that go ahead and populate. Okay, so we have Loudoun County and you could pick whatever, right? So maybe you want to have like luxury condos. You want to have only single family. You know, you want to have whatever it is that you want to have. But in this example, I'm going to use um, properties with land. So luxury homes, free list, because I said homes over a half acre. So you can pick whatever you want to have. And then I'm, I'm going to pick, I want luxury buyers. So go big or go home. And then, so I'm going to go ahead and do this, right? Why not go, you know, a million to 20 million. And let's just say that I already promised that in my example, I'm going to give homes over 0.5 acres. You could pick whatever you want, you know, country club, community, neighborhood, you know, homes for sale and River Creek so that people will get highly um, SEO, right? We wanna, we wanna get highly niche, highly targeted so that we can, you know, people will go online and say homes for sale with over, you know, half acre, homes for sale in golf course communities, homes for sale, you know, luxury townhomes near the Metro. These are the kind of things that you wanna think about that like, what is your client avatar? And then you wanna build your search around that and then create this link so that then somebody would come to it. All right. So let's just say in my example, you know, do I even care the how many bathrooms and bedrooms it is? It's over a million dollars. I'm going to hope that it has at least four bedrooms. You can decide. So I've got Loudoun County, condos, townhouse, a farm, 
You can't have um, a half acre with a condo. So I got single families and farms. I have over half acre, a million to 20 million. And then I'm going to want them to um, also, if they come back to this page, I want them to be able to register. If they uh, do two views, you could do three, you can pick whatever you want. And so I'm just going to leave it as two. And then what's going to happen is I'm going to pick generate a link, right? So this is if you want it to go to a squeeze page. If you don't, if you want to give them like a PDF, like a buyer's guide or a seller's guide, then you don't need a squeeze page, right? They're going to like click here to download the guide. This example is trying to get buyers and sellers using a landing page and a squeeze page. Okay. Lead generation, luxury home buyer in Loudoun County. We've got a list of luxury homes in Loudoun County over half an acre. We've kind of added some text here. You know, we, we would change it, right? We won't have bank owned and pre foreclosures, but you could say like included, you know, people might be like, Oh, I'm going to get a deal. Not realizing that we don't have those in our area. But anyway, so then here is the website. This is the squeeze page link that I got when I wanted to squeeze down Loudoun County, single family home, half acre. And then um, here is my page. Okay, so then uh, the background, you could pick the background. Let's just say that we wanted to have something, um, you know, pretty. You could pick acreage, you can do golf course, you know, whatever you wanted to do here. So I'm gonna go ahead and pick modern. Okay, so then we have a nice modern background and then you can pick your uh, lead type. So I'm gonna say it's a buyer. And then I'm gonna, I actually, the other thing they have to do their email, this cell phone says optional. I wanna click require. My definition of quality lead is that I have their email and their phone. Okay, that I, I don't wanna not be able to reach out to people in, in a few ways. That's my definition. We're targeting in and that's not everybody's definition, but that is uh, my standards. So then, okay. So what it said there is you better save this link. Okay. So you can create like an Excel file that maybe you want to like have some different links available to yourself. This is a how to, but just remember that's what it said. So, um, I'm going to copy this. So I'm going to right click copy control C. And so now I have a page, right? So what are you going to do with the page? Again, you want to store it somewhere. In my case, I'm going to build um, this into a custom page on my website. So rather than go ahead and give you that full tour, you could consider adding this as a, a page in your list of pages that you have on your website. I've done this for the demo. I've done this already. So um, let me just go into, this is my website, kimbarbergroup.com. Under buying, I've made this once before, Loudoun County, luxury with land. So look, this is going to look familiar. I made this different before Loudoun County homes with room to breathe. Free weekly list of homes for sale in Loudoun County over one acre. And then um, I just did this. I didn't edit all of it. Then they would enter their email, their cell phone, and then they would say, see the homes now. Now we have a landing page that's going to squeeze to that list. It's going to go into the back end of my system. And then I'm going to have a campaign and follow up with them. So that's it. And I know there's a lot of steps in there, but once you can really like nail this process and think through like, what are the kind of clients you want? What are the tools that you can use? Like landing pages also get the term funnels and squeeze pages. But it, again, just think about like where somebody's going to land. And I know that you really can get really quality leads this way. So try it out. So if you like this information, do me a favor and give me the thumbs up. That lets me know and YouTube know that you're finding this information valuable. I do have some free guides. If you are using a CRM down in the description, you can click there and we'll send them to you as well. We are having some trainings that will help you with your success in systems and strategies. You will see the link below. And if you want to know about how to get some of this stuff for free, again, lots of links below. Check it out. And I look forward to giving you more valuable content so that we can increase your success. Ooh.